is the Speedo Performance of the Week for Tuesday, November 12, 2013, presented by Pace Club. This was one of the most intense weeks of racing we've seen in a while, and naturally, that made it tough for us to pick the Speedo Performance of the Week. There were world records in Asia, high school records in Florida, and a national age group record in Arizona. But the swim that stood out the most was that incredible 45-52 in the 100-yard butterfly by Bowl School senior Joe Schooling at the Division I Florida State Championships. The time is a new national high school record, a record Schooling first set last year at the same meet with a 46-50. It's not common for swimmers to drop a full second off the national high school record, especially their own record, and it's a testament not only to Schooling's talent, but the training he got from head coach Sergio Lopez down in Jacksonville. Schooling had some tight competition for this national record. In September, Caleb Dressel took the record with a 45.89, and 24 hours after Schooling's swim, Dressel made a run at the record again, but fell four tenths short. And here's another tidbit that made Schooling worthy of this week's honor. His time in the 100 fly would have placed third at the NCAA Championships last March. Not since David Nolan's amazing national record run in 2011 has a time stood up that well against college swimmers. So for that, Joe Schooling, you've won the Speedo Performance of the Week. I'm Jeff Cummings. Thanks for watching.